obviously MasterCard, when we talk about priceless moments, we want to give you all the first opportunity to put Soul Cacao's logo next to MasterCard's logo on the sleeve of the NYCFC kit. I've been going hard all day anyway. We don't wait around when it's time and go get it. I will never fail, no, I will not fall. We gon' keep on fighting with our back against the wall. Soul Cacao is a bean to bar chocolate company founded in the South Bronx. These guys are, they're three brothers, they're 18 months apart. They each have independent careers. They're first generation from Trinidad and Tobago, but they come from third generation cacao farmers. The kind of personal and familial nature of what it is that they're doing is unbelievable. And you can tell it's infectious in terms of their passion and commitment to the craft. When COVID came, you know, all of the storefront, in-person, all of that really dried up. So for us, we, you know, we knew that no matter what, we had to make it work. We just didn't really know how. This is such a special program that really gives this wonderful business, Soul Cacao, an opportunity to be an actual sponsor of the New York City Football Club. Now on top of that, we're giving them digital resources so that they can get their business online. Working with the MLS, we were also able to, in conjunction with MasterCard, give Soul Cacao branding on the jersey sleeve for the rest of the 2021 season. Which we couldn't even imagine it was going to be as, you know, insane as it was. It was just one of those humbling experiences that really brings everything together. Like all the hard work, it's like finally, uh, you know, we're being recognized. Um, especially by our peers here in the Bronx. The most important thing that we do as a club is making sure that we impact our community in an authentic way. And being able to work with a small business, specifically one that's located here in the South Bronx, where we call home, is critically important to continuing to do the work that we as NYCFC need to accomplish as community-based organization. Opportunities like this, right, that companies that decide that they have an interest in the Bronx and that they want to grow in the Bronx, decide that they also have an interest in the people and their stories and the culture of the Bronx. I think that's the best way to make sure that our small businesses get to become bigger businesses. I mean, to work with my brothers, it's like a dream come true. It's so wonderful that, you know, we're able to come together and focus our energy on something that our great grandparents started. But more importantly, um, my brothers and I were able to move that vision forward. For us, you know, it's a lot of, you know, keep your head down and do the work. Um, at the same time, it is definitely like a little boost to know that, you know, um, you know, if we could do this, sky's the limit if we just keep working harder. At a young age, I played soccer. So to actually have a, your logo on a jersey, I felt like, you know, I joined the club. <laughs> so I feel like today just kind of showed that um, everything that we've done up until this point uh, to make the Bronx a place that you could be proud of, enjoy, um, you know, it's finally coming together. I've been going hard all day, are you with it? We don't wait around when it's time to go get it. I will never fail, no, I will not fall. If we go down, we get up and dust it off, yeah.